Hey everyone, Jeff Teague with Toyota Jeff Reviews and I am standing right beside 2024 Toyota Grand Highlander. Wait, this is the Grand Highlander? Yeah, see, look, Grand Highlander. Blinged out wheels, blinged out cargo area, and yes, a pimped out hood. Nintendo Switch OLED model. So I definitely need one of these. As a matter of fact, there's a new partnership just announced, Nintendo and Toyota partnering up Nintendo Switch OLED model and the Grand Highlander. 500 Nintendo Switches will be given to customers associated with the Grand Highlander. All right, so check out this interior here. This is crazy, right? Party Central, woo! We're gonna be playing some Mario Kart in the house here. Whoop, whoop, who's joining me? Here we go. John, Toyota product specialist. He's six foot five, my friends. Third row. Ah, comfortable and cozy. Oh, hey, wow, you've got headroom. I do have headroom. By the way, this third row reclines, and when the second row is in, which I sat in today, my friend Michael, who is six one, sat in the second row. I sat in the third row, my knees didn't touch, so it is substantially more room. Wow, that's really impressive. There's so much room back here. I love the storage space. You can fit a tablet, several water bottles even. Absolutely. Seven USB-Cs, I believe. Seven, that's exactly right, Jeff. And and uh, the little plug-ins are right here. So the third row, there's some love shown for you in the third row here. You've got your lights. There's tri-zone climate control, so they can keep you comfortable right back in your zone. So the third row has some love shown. That is awesome. Thanks so much for demoing them and the knowledge. So if you notice on Grand Highlander XLE here, look at this. We've got the LED tail lights. See, we can still tell. They're just doing balloon battle. Look at this. We've got the LED lights here and that C channel design there. Boom. And this is a smaller light bar than we have on the platinum version. Look at this, we got the matte black accent here. And of course this vehicle has been wrapped. I don't think this is gonna be one of the new colors for 24 Grand Highlander, but look at these freaking wheels. This is crazy. Yeah, I think I built that in um, my Switch Mario Kart. I always play as Yoshi, what do you guys play as? So take a look at this one here. Got turn signal indicators, blind spot, that's all standard. Let's come around here to the front. Now the XLE is gonna have the black grille. You'll see on the Platinum, that's gonna have the gray. Look at this here, whoop, whoop. Oh man, impressive, right? So first disclaimer, this is not the XLE upholstery or interior, however, do you all want it? Because I think you do. Look at this, it's incredible. And of course it's in the Nintendo colors, but this can give us a great indicator of what we're gonna get with the Highlander, no, Grand Highlander XLE. Look at this metallic accent here. And I love the way they break up a dark interior. It's kind of cool there. This is a standard 12.3 inch screen and that's a cool thing because it's not an eight inch, it's not a nine inch, standard 12.3 inches for even the entry level. That's a big deal. It has a power passenger seat. Look, seven USB-Cs as we mentioned in there. Oh, that's nice. Oh, that's a hidden pocket. I did not see that. Look how deep that goes. That goes hand deep. Ho, oh, my name's hand deep. All right, we've got power control here. We've got USBs all over the place. This one has the wireless charging pad. We could put a sport bottle down in there. We could put cup holders in here. Believe it has 13 cup holders. That's crazy, right? And this one, even in Nintendo colors, I love that. That's really cool. Look at these modes. All right, so let's get on in here. Whoa. Now look, we've got leather wrapped steering wheel here, power seat. It's cool, right? I believe the XLE is gonna have soft text interior. I might have to correct myself if I'm wrong. We got fuel release here, little trap door for whatever you want there, maybe gas money. Then we've got the power hatch. That's on the XLE on the base model, right? Very cool. Look at this here. We've got turn dials. So this is really cool. Oh, ho. Very nice. Look at our drive modes here. We got eco, sport, normal, and we got trail on this particular one. EV mode. 
I just got to check and make sure what's going to be on each one as it comes out because sometimes if they're show cars, they might not exactly be that way. So it's got electronic parking brake with brake hold and look at this. I'm sitting in the seat right now and I feel the vibrations. I'm picking up good vibrations from that huge speaker in back. So look, we can go across here, turn our safety features on and off. That's kind of cool. That's interesting because it's different from the all digital one that you would see in Okay, so that's off in the Platinum. Now look at this one here. This one has Toyota Safety Sense 3.0. It's got four settings. A lot of us are used to seeing three settings for that radar cruise control. So we can do intuitive commands. We can say, hey Toyota. We can say, hi Toyota, okay Toyota. Hello Toyota, just like that. And it'll pick up my commands. I don't wanna do it right now though, because Toyota will say, what are you doing? Do drive modes, trip information, history, energy flow, and then any type of vehicle alerts that we might have. We can also set up our individual profiles. So that's a cool thing there. Bluetooth, you can pair two devices at the same time, get your preferences, and you could switch between cars, your profile that have this Toyota Audio Multimedia. That's a big deal right there. So look at that. I like vehicle customized because you can adjust your light settings, your door control settings, climate, utility. Pretty nifty, my friends. Then we've got sunglass holder, we've got lights up here, safety connect. Ho, oh, we got that right there. Boom, shaboom. Uh. And then we've got microphone for the passenger. This particular one has a big giant moonroof in it, the Pano. It could be because it's a show car. So hey, let's take a look. If you want more information on Grand Highlander, here's the QR code. You can just scan that one, I believe. And then look here, we've got 362 horsepower, 400 pound-feet of torque. That's with the Hybrid Max. So we've got three different powertrains here. You can go with the XLE and get the 2.4 liter turbo gas or you can get the hybrid. This is the 2.5 liter with electric motor assist. This is gonna give you 34 MPG. So that's right up there with traditional Highlander hybrid. That's a big deal for a bigger car, for a heavier car, fantastic MPG. Hey everybody, what do you think about Grand Highlander, Grand Highlander XLE? What about that space where John showed us all the room in the third row? Boom, at six foot five. I couldn't have pulled that off, no. Uh -uh. So, what do you think about that partnership with Nintendo and Toyota? Could you be a lucky recipient of a Switch? But for right now, let's get into the game. How do you like that? Thanks for subscribing. I'm at Toyota Jeff Reviews and Auto Jeff Reviews, Instagram, TikTok, and YouTube. See you next time.